Hey, what's up, you guys? This is your boy, Melvin Tim Tim with coming at you with another video. So I want to discuss um, the everyday struggle, which is the um, hip-hop kind of show that's on Complex News on the web, versus The Breakfast Club. And here's my thing. I look at the everyday struggle versus The Breakfast Club as, if you remember back in the late 90s, early 2000s, it was TRL versus One Sister Park. I consider this like TRL versus One Sister Park. To me, the Breakfast Club would be TRL, and the Everyday Struggle would be One Sister Park. Uh, because of the fact that the Breakfast Club, you know, you have Charlamagne God, you know, he says it's on his mind and, and everything. But, you know, they do have mostly hip-hop artists on, but sometimes they'll go to, like, the world of reality TV and they'll go to pop. So they do have those pop elements about it. Um, the other day, you know, as I think somebody somebody said, um, I think it may have been Charlamagne Collin, Joe Buttons, Joe the Journalist. And I, I, I do agree with that. I like that name, Joe Jones. However, they were talking about how complex, excuse me, how complex news may cancel the everyday struggle. I hope that complex news does not cancel the everyday struggle because to me, it is something that's needed because the difference between it and the Breakfast Club is, yes, the Breakfast Club does have hip-hop on its own, but the everyday struggle breaks down hip-hop out. It breaks down um, hip-hop tier number one, tier number two, and and album sales and discusses just what the hip hop game means to me. And to me, especially with One Assistant Park being canceled, that is something that is really, really needed. It's something that's really, really needed. And um, I look at it as fact that, like, for example, you have Baby Girl on there, and you have Joe Bunge, you have DJ Academics. I'll say this thing about DJ Academics. The thing I love about DJ Academics is this. He always tried to come with, anytime he comes with the, comes with the reply back at Joe Buttons, he will come with a zip, and I love that for DJ Academics. Sometimes he will he will backpedal every now and then. I don't know whether that's because, you know, Joe's personality is so strong and aggressive, but I got to say, for the most part, I think he, he, he kind of holds his own up there. Um, Joe Buttons, this is what I say about Joe Buttons, a lot of people really got to the everyday struggle when he had a situation with Lil, Lil Yachty, and I say this, um, a lot of stuff sometimes Joe says he means well, he's on point with what he says, but here's my problem. To me, it, the, the reason why a lot of people say you come off as a bitter old head is because I come from the era where I love Tupac and I love Big, Biggie, but at the same time, you do kind of seem like a bit old head because the way you say something to come people, yeah, it's kind of, excuse my language, it's, it's kind of assholes Polish, excuse my language. But um, I got to say, um, you know, he, he's doing his thing. It, it, it's well, it's well, man. I, I love the show. I can say this. When it comes to everyday struggle versus the Breakfast Club, I'm not going to tell no story. I watch the Breakfast Club because it may be a guest on there I want to see. Because sometimes if it's a guest I don't know I want to see, I'm, I'm not going to be honest. I, I probably skip over and don't watch it. But when it comes to everyday struggle, I watch every single episode. And with one of the part being off the air, that is so, so needed in this hip-hop community. So I want to say that um, Complex News, do not cancel the everyday struggle. It's reaching people. It's a great, great show. And it's something that's very, very needed. I think also you guys need to expand upon it and make it even bigger. I would love, personally me, I would love you to bring on another female host. Somebody who's very vocal. Somebody who could... um who could maybe stand up against Joe, I think that would take the show to another level. I would love to see you bring somebody like, um, I would love to see you bring somebody like MC Light on, you know? I, I think she would be great on um, Everyday Struggle. I would love to see you bring somebody like um, Yo-Yo on. So Everyday Struggle needs to continue. If I gotta say, I gotta pick a winner between Everyday Struggle and Breakfast Club, I gotta say Everyday Struggle. You guys have an awesome, beautiful, and blessed day. Love you guys. Bye.